What's up Rangers? So before we begin today's episode, I want to tell you that I would like you to join my Patreon page. Go to www.patreon.com forward slash Ranger Rick TV and by your pledge of $2 a month, you'll receive a simple thank you by me in the tier 1 package. For $5 a month in the tier 2 package, I'll feature your name in the ending credits in each video, plus a simple thank you as well. If you do not wish to pledge, that's okay. Thanks anyway. Now enjoy the show. What's up, Rangers? Welcome back on today's episode. I am extra excited for today's episode, and I'll tell you the reason why. I'm in one of the most exquisite, drop-dead gorgeous Time Capsule Schools auditorium I've ever seen in my life. I want to tell you about this place from top to bottom. I want to show you from top to bottom. Stick around and let's explore. In this episode, I will show you something extraordinary. An abandoned Roman Catholic elementary school frozen in time. From the eerie hallways to the forgotten classrooms and a decaying theater, this place is a time capsule of history and lost memories. When stepping inside, I couldn't believe in the preservation of history and the rich traditions that have been carefully maintained over the years. This school is over a century old, and you have to think about the generations of children that pass through these halls and classrooms, leaving everything behind. I think I found the jackpot room, honestly. Look at all this cool looking stuff. We got a Pinocchio, Winnie the Pooh. Look at all these faces in here. Could you imagine? Oh, that's an eyeball. That's a cow eye. That's a clamshell. This place almost looks like it should be in a museum. It's so well preserved that it seems like everyone just left yesterday. But that isn't the case. The school opened in 1892, but abruptly closed in 2012. Now I ask you, my subscribers, to come inside with me and let's explore and see what we can find. guys <laughs> all right rangers you're not gonna believe this this is probably one of the best schools i've ever seen because it is a complete time capsule this whole thing is abandoned and guess what it is spotless everything about this place is miraculous i cannot get enough everything in here is a complete work of art this is probably beyond my pay grade. I don't think I've ever visited a place this much of a pristine time capsule ever. Like, look at this. You see everybody's school pictures? Everything is pristine. Oh my God. This is just, and this is only the first room. All the rooms look like this, y'all. I don't know if I'm going to show you every single room, but like, this is just, this is really a work of art. I don't want to spend too much time in this room because there's a lot to see. Look at this. Oh my God. The clock is still working. I haven't done my homework on this place yet. I'll probably tell you that in the beginning of the intro, but like, I, I think this school is probably over a century old but that's all I know, and it is abandoned, freshly abandoned, and I am so privileged 
to come here. I cannot believe this. Room 106, look at this. I can't believe I got in here. How did I even manage this? I have no idea. Just show up at the right place at the right time and it's, you're in. Holy Trinity, God is love. Priest, one God, deacons doing good, rosary, Christmas, and it just goes on. Holy water, mass. This is just, oh my God. I, I can't, like, this place is just too good. Oh my God. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is just, oh my God. And look, they all have their rosaries on the desk. Look at them. All of them have their little rosaries. Remember these little desks in high school? Oh, I remember these desks in high school, actually. Back in like the 90s, we still had these. These are like from the 60s. They put these here. I don't even know if they upgraded the furniture over time. Probably not. Amazing. Now that leads to upstairs, as we can see, but I'm not gonna head up there just yet. This is what's up. I love this place. I don't know if that's actually a good sign or not. There is an alarm there. And if you hear banging on in the background, they're actually working right outside the door right there, <laughs> which is not a good thing. But uh, let's keep it moving. Look at this. Another amazing classroom. I hope I get enough time to do my cinematics here because like every room is like a complete time capsule. I don't do enough schools on this channel, but I should. Like I got some schools and stuff in my backlog, but I feel like I don't have enough of them. But maybe I should start doing more. This is so cool. Yeah, this is, this is definitely Catholic based. I'm Catholic, ain't nothing wrong with that. I don't really practice my religion, but it's what I am. Look at this, beautiful. Yeah, this is like way beyond my pay grade here. This is nuts. This is complete insanity. Oh wait, wait a minute, what? October 2022, this place just closed, I think. Or did it? This is 2022 calendar. What the, and look, we have another rosary right here. I thought these were Mardi Gras beads at first, <laughs> but they're not. Look at this. It's amazing. This is just insane. I know I talk too much, y'all, but I'm excited. And the more I'm excited about something, the more I'm passionate about something, guess what? I talk a lot. Close that. I am actually an introvert at heart, but I tell you what, abandoned spots, some reason, they just make me an extrovert. And it's always been that way. I come out of my shell. This has got to be the front door. Yeah, look at outside. Still snowing out there. Yeah, this is definitely, definitely the front. Peace to all who enter here. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. See that, you pray to Jesus, good things come to you, right? Like this place, this is awesome. I wonder how big this place is, this is amazing. Oh, that's locked. I wonder if we can still get in there though. And what is this? Here's room 103. 103. Oh, what is all of this stuff? I'm wondering, wait a minute. Can we turn on the lights? I'm used to power not being on. Hold on. One, two. Holy God. Holy God. <laughs> the power's on. Oh, look at these drawings. 
Do y'all see this? This is just, this is too much, y'all. I'm so in love with this spot. This is like automatically one of my favorite spots. Every room is a time capsule. This, this is beautiful. This is so beautiful. God. I think this, yeah, I'm pretty sure this was like a Catholic based school. I'm not even sure if it was a high school. I don't think it was a high school. It could have been, I don't know. What did they use this room for? Nothing, I guess. And I know I keep saying, oh my God, oh my God. But really, oh my God, like, I am so excited to be here, y'all. I mean, it's, it's like the perfect opportunity. I have no idea how this happened, but I'm here. And I love it. What is this? Oh, this is a bathroom? This is so weird looking. This is honestly really cool, though. Look at this. Let me stand away. This is a, somebody's bathroom here. I don't know if this is a girl's bathroom or not, but it's a bathroom. Look at that. Whew. Oops. Look at that. Mickey Mouse right there. We got Goofy and him, Donald Duck. Look at all that. Daffy Duck. Dinky Duck. All that stuff. Can we get in here though? Yes, we can. Jeez. All right. I know I haven't explored much yet in this place. Let me turn on the power. Yep, all the power's still running. I know I haven't explored much yet in this place, but this by far is my favorite classroom because it feels like the most cozy. Like the, the other classrooms kind of felt like cold, but this one feels warm. Yeah, this is, this is beautiful. This is, oh my. And yes, I am salivating because I love stuff like this. The complete time capsule. That's an old cast register for kids. Oh my God. <laughs> Did that really just open? Oh, it just opened. <laughs> wow, what is this? It's a ball. You hear the floors when you step on them? Oh, look at that, that's cool. That's like the Jungle Book. Look at that. That is nifty. I love that. We got Mowgli over there. Where's Baloo at? Oh wait, that was another episode. You got the snake right there, the ducks, the monkeys, yeah. And just remember to wash your hands, kids, before you touch food, before you eat, after you use toilet, after you sneeze or cough. That's what's up. Make sure you do that or else. Now what is this? Eh, nope, storage closet. Nothing interesting in here. But why would you put cartoon characters in a storage closet? I don't know. Let's keep it moving. All right, just kind of working our way down here. This is room 102. So this is kind of near the front-ish. One, two. Yeah, this is, this must have been a young person's classroom, I think. Cause look how, look how tiny the desks are. They're like minuscule. <laughs> this one's a little bit bigger though. Must be for the big boy in the classroom. This is so cool. I love these little exhibits here, these nativity scenes. Oh, this is, oh man. I love church stuff. I really do. It just doesn't do that good on YouTube, like religious stuff. It just doesn't perform well, but I still love these places. I'm gonna start doing more of them. 
And look at this. I think these kids in here were mostly Spanish because all of this is in Spanish. Praise Jesus. Back of the class felt like when you were sitting at the back of the class because I, in my classroom, like in my high school or in my school, I would always sit usually like right there, right at the edge of the front where nobody else is on that side or like somewhere in like the back on the left hand side. I don't know why I just never did. I don't like being around too many people. I'm kind of antisocial like that, but like whenever I explore, don't get me wrong, I'm an introvert, but when I explore, I'm an extrovert. I love it. So I'm a little bit of both. Let's turn off these lights respectively and let's keep it moving. 101, here we go. Oh my, look at this floor. What is up with this floor? It looks really cool. Oh boy. And look at that clock right there. Everything about this place is a complete time capsule. Jeez. Look at the fan, it still has a fan. I wonder if the fan works, I'm not gonna pull it. No, I don't want to do all of that stuff. I don't want to leave stuff running, I might forget. Here's some chalk. Ranger. Rick. TV. Yes, indeed. Let's turn off these lights. Every now and then I keep on hearing things and it's this thing making noise. I didn't catch it on camera, but it went and What do we have here in this room? Please throw away sanitary napkins, tampons, and tissues in the garbage can. Do not flush down the toilet. Thank you. Someone tells me this is more like a teacher's area. It says, smile. Smiles come in every color. That's a cool looking mural. If I do the same for myself. Let's not mess with any of that. We're not here to do that. I'm just here to take pictures, explore what is the unknown. And this is truly a blessing. I love it here. I don't want to leave. Wow. It is hotter down here, much hotter. This is like the basement or something. Oh, this is like, uh, like a little rec room area. I don't really need my light. It is, hold on. It is hot down here, good gracious. This is just too good. Yeah, this had to be like their little rec uh, area center. I guess where they did like sing-alongs and their like church meetings and stuff, maybe. I don't know, maybe it was the cafeteria or do we even get to that part yet? I don't know. But hear me out. What is back here? This says men. So I'm guessing. Oh, maintenance room. Probably not gonna be interested. It's locked anyway. kitchen. Here's the kitchen. Check and see what's going on inside the kitchen. Lights, do we have them? Yes, we do. This is definitely, um, I would say this is definitely for the teachers. This is not for the children whatsoever. Maybe they had teachers meetings in here and stuff. Coffee maker. I know you guys don't want to see this room too much, but I'm showing you anyway, just in case. Hello? What is that noise? Hello? What the hell? There's somebody in here. Y'all hear that? Is there somebody trying to get in here? Nobody's at the window. Is it this heater making that noise? Y'all, if that's that heater making that noise, that is creepy. Holy moly, look at the urinals. 
I like these. These are great, because, especially for men, because men tend to get it all over themselves. I don't know how you know, we do that. It's just a thing. <laughs> but when you go all the way to the floor with it, we don't get nothing on the floor. <laughs> all right. I apologize, but that's probably more information than what you needed to know. And this is the girl's lavatory. What is a lavatory? You mean a bathroom? Maybe that's how you say it in Spanish. I don't know. Write it down in the comments, y'all, but this is beautiful. Look at this. This trip, by far, I'm not going to say by far, but it was one of my better trips because almost every spot that I went to, I got inside. Almost. I was unlucky with a few of them, but I did happen to have a lot of good luck. So there you go. Wow. I love the pink. We got full power going on inside this room. Here's the main power section for it. It's too loud in there. How come every school had big blast doors like this back in the day? Look how massive these doors, this is all steel. That is all solid. I just made it to this top of the stairwell. And look how beautiful that is. Good gracious. That is nice. So beautiful. Very cold day today exploring. I'm out of breath from doing that. <sighs> Let's keep it moving. Does this go up to? Wait a minute, what? Hold on. Well, right now I'm on the second floor, but like there's another stairwell that leads up this room. I usually like to do it in segments, but I'll have to do this right now. I may not get another opportunity to come back here and do it. What the heck? Oh, that's the big bad wolf. Well, we'll put that back because we don't want to mess with him too much. He looks like he's been here for a long time. Very long time. I think I found the jackpot room, honestly. Look at all this cool looking stuff. We got a Pinocchio. Winnie the Pooh. This is great. This is fantastic. Look at all these faces in here. Could you imagine? People used to wear these. These must have been, you know what? If you Google Halloween costumes, do me a favor, y'all. Do me a favor, y'all, I'm serious. When you get a moment, go on Google and type in Halloween costumes from the early 1900s. They're black and white photos. They're the most horrific costumes you have ever seen in your life. And you wanna know something? Like these. Children used to wear this as Halloween costumes and they were absolutely the most terrifying Halloween costumes I've ever seen, ever. Whether they be used for a play for Halloween or whatever, they're horrific, horrible looking costumes. Like, they'll probably put dents in your mind and that's not a good thing. Let's close this door. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm going too quick. Let's go up here first. And we just made it up the stairs. As you can see, and what do we have in here? Jeez, look at all these desks in here. What are they doing? What did I just find? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold on, what is this? Oh, this is the place that has that that I was looking for? What? Are you kidding me? Wait, hold on. No. This is the third floor. Wait a minute, hold on y'all, this is too soon. This is too soon. I can't show this stuff right now, hold on. 
All right, y'all, hear me out. This is too soon to see this. I'm just trying to save that for last. I kind of did it out of order, but at least you got a sneak peek. Right now, we're on the third floor. Let's go back to the second. Let me show you that. Totally did that out of order. Now, look at this. Back in the day, they did not build stuff up to code. I am trying to cross right here, and my neck is cutting right into it. So, this is normal steps that you take to get up this, the um, auditorium, and that's what happens. They did not build places up to cold or for tall people, and I'm not even all that tall. I'm decently tall, but you know, average, whatever. All right, whew, let's close this. This place got me all out of breath and everything. Why is that there? Is that real? That is real. Let's go in here. Let's check it out. All right, back. Dude, what the hell is that? Oh, that was my own reflection. Jeez. This place got me all messed up. All right, let's try to find a light switch. <clears throat> all right. Here is a classroom, just like we've been seeing. Y'all want it with the lights on, or do you want it with the lights off? I don't know, y'all leave it in the comments, but we'll do some rooms with the light on, some rooms with the light off, because I can't decide. For video, it kind of looks better with the lights on, but for pictures, it looks better with the lights off. Same thing in the bedroom, giggity. All right, so this is what we got. All right, I'm, I'm clowning today, y'all. This is what we got here laid out. As you can tell, we got orange, blue, got a little green over there. I love the mix of colors. But some of these desks in here were not updated. This is kind of like afterthoughts. This is where you put the bad kids. That's where you put the good kids. That's actually bro science, it's not real, but I figure I'd throw that in, in there anyway. <laughs> I apologize, y'all, I'm excited. All of this is in Spanish. Gracias. Here's a TV, which still has power. I don't know if I should actually turn that on though. Let's see, what were they watching? The Passion of the Christ. That's a good movie. I wonder if we get it working. Uh, the TV is not coming on. Do I have to use this? It is not coming on. We could have watched Passion of the Christ, y'all. It's plugged in. Yeah, everything's plugged in here. What the heck? Is this chalk? No, this is the eraser. What the hell? Yeah, it did erase. That's a big ass eraser. Why is it white, though? Another good shot of the cemetery. That is so beautiful. Dang, I wanna get out there. That is so gorgeous. Let's get a good shot. What's going on outside? This is beautiful, y'all. Wow, and look at the ceiling. The ceiling's beautiful in its own right, too. Back in New Orleans, I used to go to a school that was kind of like this, very time capsule-esque, and I remember it had that type of ceiling like that, which is really cool. Now this is another room. Let's do this with the lights off, because why not keep the lights off for this room? Immediately when I walked in this room, I had no idea what the heck this was, but now I'm kind of figuring it out. This looks very modern. This is a projector that projects right here. Why did they look like that? I have no idea. I've never seen one that actually looks like that. That is weird looking. Maybe for your PowerPoint presentations and stuff. This is my favorite thing back in school and especially high school. When the teachers brought these out, everybody fell asleep. This, this is like the best day ever. <laughs> as soon as they brought that out, we all fell asleep. I graduated high school back in 2001, and that was quite a long time ago. But uh, before that, like in the 90s, that's kind of what we had. You know, we didn't have all this digital stuff like there is now. Everything was tangible, you know what I'm saying? You can actually hold it in your hand, like a VCR tape. Put it either right in there, or right in there. This is awesome. Let's take a look at it with the lights on now. Lights off. 
Oh, look. The fan. That's how you turn the fan on. And it still works to this day. Give a shout out to my number one fan. I'm gonna turn you off though. Gotta turn you off. What is in here? <clears throat> that is locked. That's locked, can we get in? Get in through this side? No. Well, you could, but you would have to move this thing from that door. I'm not doing all that, but something makes me think there's something really good in there. Maybe I could do this. Hold on, I got an idea. All right, talk amongst yourselves. Give me one second, here we go. What about this? Uh, looks like a bunch of books. I don't know, maybe some chemicals in there and stuff. Let me try to zoom in on it. Y'all bear with me. Ugh. Can y'all see anything? I don't know. Looks like a cool room, but nothing really interesting. But it is locked. I have a number on it, but we're gonna check it out anyway. Oh, it's locked. Can't get in. What is in there? Nothing really, it's just more classrooms. For some reason, this hallway is completely dark. Whoa, what the heck? Oh, this is sweet. Please, can we get in here? Please. It is locked. That is awesome. Y'all seeing this? That's the library. Oh, man. I want to get in there bad. Oh, let's try to figure it out, y'all. Look, y'all, y'all seeing this? Look at that. This is locked. Try one more time. No, that's locked. Shit. Oh. What about this? Is this locked too? Pray that this is not locked. It's locked. Shit. Well, this is about as close as we gonna get, y'all. Let me try to figure something out. Talk amongst yourselves. Oh, look at that knight in shining armor over there. See the knight? It's like a knight statue. Oh, I gotta get in there. This is awesome. Hold on. Talk amongst yourselves. I'm gonna find a way in. Let's see, we just opened this door right here. This has got to be like a teacher's lounge or something. Oh, look at this. We have a helmet, a knight's helmet from the King Arthur days. It's probably a replica, but it's still cool to see that. Here we go. We made it inside the library. Wow. Holy. Oh my goodness, holy moly. Oh my God, I am thoroughly impressed. And you wanna know something? It smells just like a library would. This brings back so many memories from the past, back in my old school days. Didn't look like they used this library in quite some time though. Like everything looks very time capsule-esque. Here's the, um, the light switch. Oh yeah. This is what's up. Oh man. Sorry guys if I'm moving a little bit too fast for you, but this one is under some circumstances. This place is being watched very carefully. And that's why I'm kind of speeding along because I want to show you everything, but it's dang near impossible. Look at this. Pope John Paul, he was probably like the best Pope ever. He wasn't bought out by politics or anything like that. The Virgin Mary, a lot of Virgin Marys in here. Here's a football hat. And you put it on top of your head, just like that, like a regular football helmet. Maybe we can explore like this all day, huh? Just walk around in the building, in the abandoned building with a thing on our head like this. <laughs> all right, I gotta stop y'all, we cutting up. Look at this. I can't stop looking around, this is amazing. This y'all, here's the best part. What in the heck did I just find? A knight in shining rusted armor. Look at that, huh? Guys, give me a like on this channel right now for finding stuff like this. This is made out of all iron. 
or steel or metal or whatever it is. It's very light. Maybe it's not steel. It's maybe just regular metal. But look at this. Oh, this is great. Finding stuff like this. Yeah, this is awesome. This is too cool. Oh, man. What else do we have in here? Here's an old fan from looks like the 70s. Very satisfying buttons. I grew up with one of these. Except mine was blue. National Geographics from 2005. So this school was still in operation kind of late on in the game. I don't know when it became abandoned, but I'll look into it. Look at this. It's got everything in here. It's amazing. This is just too cool. MLK. Okay, since my years of exploring abandoned places and abandoned buildings, MLK had a lot to do with abandoned places that are no longer in use. For some reason, it was just like that, especially in the South, you know? Whenever I explore abandoned place in the South, his name would come up constantly in my stories. Look at this. Animal Paradise. These books look so old. How old are these books? This looks like it's from the freaking 30s. <laughs> Do we have a date when this thing was last rented out? No. I don't even know how old this book is, but I remember back in the day, like back in the 80s and stuff, they used to put th these little plastic wraps over the books. It kind of feels like plastic. They don't do that anymore. But you could tell these were some old, old books. Like they even, like, let me see. Ah, oh, I remember that smell. It's bringing back so many memories, very nostalgic memories. All right, guys, <laughs> I'm just getting too carried away in here. I love it. I love time capsule stuff. And I can't get over like how good it smells in here too. It smells just like an old library. Let's turn off the light. And there was two lights to this. So let's turn off this light. But first, I'm gonna ring the bell. That's what's up. I'm gonna turn off these lights. And it says push to call. I th I, that probably calls the principal in her office or his office. All right, um, let's get out of this room and let's keep it moving. But you get the idea. What if we learned today about this library? I don't know about you guys, but I learned it's probably one of the coolest libraries that's abandoned that I've ever seen. It's got a, little, a lot of cool books. They smell really good. And it's got a knight in shining armor. Shout out to the Pope. Look at all these old movies too. Oh, what? This is what's up y'all. Turbo Power Rangers movie. They had this back then like that? Wow. The Mighty Ducks. I remember that movie. That was a classic instant hit movie with the younger generation anyway. Yeah, this is awesome. Miss Piggy's Christmas. Robin Hood. All this stuff, man. This is so cool to see all this. Look at the Virgin Mary just hanging out right here, holding the fort down with the rosary and her roses. Came across from the room behind us. We're going inside here, but one thing I noticed, it's locked. Somebody busted the window, and that's the only thing you can really see on the inside. Let me turn the light off so you can see, you guys. Another time capsule room. Man, I want to get in there. I don't think there's no way inside that one, that's for sure. Give a shout out to the pencil sharpener right there. Look at this room, y'all. Jeez. They just keep getting better and better. I love looking at all this stuff. Yeah, all of this, all these words right here in complete Spanish. I don't read Spanish, but I know a lot of people do. I just use a Google Translate, but at least you get the idea where we're at. 
what's going on. This is awesome. Look at this podium. I love the color of this. Very green. Look at all these chairs and everything in here. Just, oh man. Watch this. Look at the hands. Is that what our hands were made out of? The Virgin Mary is turning into a robot. <laughs> look at this hand. And look at this hand. It's like a T-800 hand, like a Terminator hand. Uh-oh. We got company. Yeah, it's just an ambulance. Let's get away from the window because we don't want to disturb anybody. Let's give a shout out to the time right there because it's still ticking. That's the kind that ran not on a battery, but actually on power. Let's turn off the lights. You come inside this room right here and for some reason, all the stuff is all kind of just tossed around here. I think they used this, for, uh, this room for storage maybe. It's called the Word Hall. That's what it says right there. Y'all see that? It says the Word Hall. It's kind of dark in here. Look at that. I just noticed something. Really can't get up underneath that, but y'all see that right there? Something tells me this is a, yeah, this is a drop ceiling, and there was another ceiling above that. Here's another room. Oh, man. Oh, wait. Oh, it's open. It's open. It's open. Oh, this is cool. Like, everybody just formed a complete circle, and... This is what we ended up with. Let me go on this side where it's a little bit better with the lighting. Yeah, this is like way better with the lighting. Flows better. This is amazing. Wow. I mean, I could literally stay in here all day and just explore this place all day. And they have the heater on too and it's cold outside. It's perfect. It got so hot in here, I had to take my jacket off. M-A-T-R-I-M-O-N-I-O. -I -I yeah, this is definitely like Spanish or something. Do a shout out. Look at that. Beautiful. Oh yeah, this thing's still working. Off. Oh, Ooh, this is hot. Dang. Oh, that's too hot. That's too hot. Those old school heaters, man, they probably burn these places down like that. I love how they just lay everything out for you on the table like that. This is cool stuff too. Another cross. This place is loaded with them. This is called the teacher's lounge and it is locked. Dang it. All right, what is this one? Room 205. Let's try it out. Oh, here we go. Now this is a little bit different. These rooms in here have desks like this. They have tables. They do have desks though. I will give them that. But these are like mostly like tables and stuff in here. Why do they do that? I don't know. They have a couple pianos, because say it with me, no abandoned place is complete without pianos. So let's play them. That works. Sounds actually really good. Seems very well tuned. Oh, I can't, nope, can't play because I got a little vice grip on it. Yeah, that one probably plays too, I don't know. This is so cool. It does smell kind of gassy in here. Y'all smell it? Wait, y'all hear that? Oh, this, this thing's kind of leaking gas. Like, look at this. Or is that just steam? Y'all see that on camera? Huh. It kind of smells gassy in here. I mean, not like crazy smelling, but it does kind of. All these religious figures and everything on the wall. And found a 
the water fountain. Let's see if it works. No, I didn't cut the water off. Nope. Definitely cut the pop all the water off on of that one. Yeah, this is like extra dark in here. Extra, extra dark. I wonder why this hallway is so dark. It's very dimly lit in here. It's locked. I don't think this is a high school. I think it was like totally something else here. Did we get in here yet? No, we didn't, I don't think. What is back here? I don't think I explored this part yet. I'm getting lost, a little lost. This opens, it looks like. It's actually, yeah, hmm, can't get in there. Not through here anyway, let's try another way. All right, let's make our way to the third floor. See you on the flip side. What is all this stuff in here? Water girl mask, what? Oh my God. <laughs> that scared the bejesus out of me. I thought somebody was looking at me <laughs> through the window. And it turns out just to be this thing. What the heck? What in the hell is that? Oh. Oh, you could take this out. You could take the heart out and everything. You could take the eyeballs out. Yeah, this is like cool. This had to be like the laboratory or something, huh? Oh man, I struck gold. I totally struck gold with this place. Wow. Jeez. Some coral. I'm totally in awe right now, y'all blown away. Oh yeah, this is definitely the lab. Definitely the laboratory. Squeeze in it. What in the hell is that stuff? Hold the phone, hold the phone. Oh, that's an eyeball. That's a cow eye. That's a clamshell. That's a, a frog. What the heck? Earthworms. That's a sea star in there. Can we see that? What? Kernels of corn. What in the hell is this thing? That is a kidney. Ooh, this is sick. I love it. <laughs> Y'all, I'm like salivating over this stuff. This is so cool. A rainbow colored brain. Is that even a thing? <laughs> Don't hate me off in the comments, y'all. Don't hate me in the comments, please. Oh man, what the hell? What is this? This is like samples of some, like blood samples or something. Look at this, microscopes and everything. This place is loaded. Let's keep searching. place is absolutely loaded. I love this spot. Who the hell did that? Come on, y'all. <laughs> What's up with this? Oh. Wow. Wow, wow, freaking wow. This is just... I'm completely floored. This is a gear train. That's cool. All right. Wait a minute, what is this? Oh, 
oh, this was like the sun, and you would like move the planets around and everything. Look at that little mic microscope right there. This is so cool. I can't even. <laughs> now we're finally starting to see some decay, as you can see right there, and on that side too. What's up with this? Eh, just a regular classroom. Ooh, there's pictures. Not people pictures, but animal photos. More nativity scenes. Just prepare yourselves. This is what I wanted to show you. This part right here. This is beautiful. This is what you call a work of art. This is so cool. I love this. Let's try to get a better shot of it from upstairs. Let's try to make our way up there somehow. Can't move through here, can we? I don't know. Let's try it. Can we even go this way? My backpack is too thick. Oh, shoot. Ah, all right, here we go. Whoa. Man, I was not expecting this from the outside of this building. Don't let it fool you. Good Lord. All right, let's go over here. Let's see what it, this is. Oh, this is the exit. We gotta be careful. This building is finally showing its age. Oh, that's not gonna open. It's definitely not gonna open. Let's see if we can go down this way. It's like the higher you go in this place, uh, the more decayed it's getting. So you have to watch every step you take because you can easily fall through the floor. Look at this. How do you get up there? This is so cool. Look at all the detail. Y'all see the detail in that? Oh, that's made out of, that's metal. What was this made out of? That's still metal. Wow. And this is what it looked like kind of down here, right at the foot of the stage. This is gorgeous. Jeez. This is nuts. So I just made it up the fourth floor. This is the fourth floor. Um, all I gotta say is I love the lighting in this room. This is like the best lighting ever. And it is cold up here. Very cold. The attic, I am not walking on any of that. This is definitely the attic. I love the lighting here. So gorgeous. That's where you kept the bad kids. What about this room? What is this room? Very cold in here. Why are they writing a whole bunch of graffiti on these walls up here? How old is this? All these writings and stuff. Look at the blast steel door right here. It's made out of metal. Feels like a blast door. That's from 1990. All right, let's keep it moving. I love this room though. All right, what is in here? Oh yes, this is what we came to see, my babies. <sighs> Look at this, y'all. This is complete jibba jabba, wow. Wow, wow, wow. This is, this is gorgeous. <sighs> As I look around in here, I love abandoned places. Anyone know one thing about this place? It doesn't smell bad at all. No water or anything like that is dripping in. I mean, maybe a little bit. You do have some damage up there, but it's not bad. 
This is awesome. But this place does not smell like your typical abandoned place. It smells good, actually. Like, clean. Like, they took care of this place a lot. Um, how do you get around here without tripping over things? All right, so I guess like that. I w oh, excuse me. Um, I wish we had power here, but we do not. So we're gonna have to work with what we got, which is still really cool. But, well, let's look at the windows. Snowing its butt off. Jeez. Look at that. That is really something else. Turn up the exposure just a little bit here because I'm not getting much feedback around here. There's not enough light reflection off of these panels. It's very dark in this room, like extremely dark. And it's dark outside, it's snowing today. And very, very, very cold. Oh man, look at that, that's beautiful. Let's come down, let's go ahead and dip down here. Let's see what we got. Standing at the foot of the atrium here. I'm not the atrium, the auditorium. Let's take a quick glance up at what we got. And you gotta make that little sound effect there. Or else it won't zoom correctly. Look at that, so pretty. Um, can we walk along this thing without busting our face wide open? Hope not. Let's get this up. Oh, I like, I like the seats, they were labeled. Wait a minute, six. Where's seven? Eight. Where's nine? That's ten. They were not in order. For whatever reason. Assigned seating? Yes, maybe. But other than that, no. This is what's up. This is what Urbex is completely all about. I, I love this stuff. You get to go to places most people won't. That's metal. So all this stuff is made out of metal. I didn't even know that. I thought it was made out of like plaster work or something like wood. Yeah. One word about this place. Yeah. What the hell is that? I just saw a shadow. I'm not even joking you. I just saw a shadow cross like right over there in that section where that beam is. That is weird. It's like, it was, I'm, not, I'm not even joking. Like, I, I, I got, <laughs> excuse me. Like, I got good sleep last night, but I totally just saw a shadow figure walk right around there. And I think I caught that on camera too. That is so weird. I was just over there. Okay, well, if that don't freak you, I don't know what will. So, um, let's go back up here. <laughs> <laughs> and let's leave that alone. What is this room all about? Oh, here's another well-lit room. Wait, did we do... Did we come in here yet? No, we didn't. Oh, this is the other side. Yeah, this is like the other side of the place. The other side of the attic, anyway. I'm not walking in there. No water damage, that's good. But what do we have here? Here's some more graffiti. What do we have here? Hit this door. Nothing really. It's just nothing. Nicole, 19. What the? Oh, it stinks so bad in here. What does that smell? What is in here? Y'all, something don't smell right. It smells like something died. What is that? Oh, it stinks so bad. All right, I'm getting out of here. Jeez, what does that smell? Boy, stinks. What is up with all the chairs in here, y'all? Just walked inside of this classroom and look at it. They're literally stacked to the ceiling. <laughs> this is wild. It's like a 
game of Tetris. How do you even go about doing this? This is crazy. This is awesome. I love this spot. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs>